Every year, millions of people damage their phones through contact with water or other liquids. P2i has the answer. P2i's nano coatings offer invisible protection against liquid damage. Our patented range of applications provide protection levels spanning from exposure to high humidity or rain, to accidental splashes and spills, and even the occasional drop in the sink. Working directly with manufacturers all over the world, P2i's splash-proof technology has been seamlessly integrated into existing assembly lines. The machines are easy to operate at the touch of a single button. The product is placed into the P2i machine, and the process begins by lowering the air pressure within the chamber. Once the pressure has been reduced, a plasma process then activates the entire surface of the device. With the surface now activated, the monomer is introduced as a vapor which permeates every feature of the device, coating the whole phone both inside and out. This invisible technology, which is 1,000 times thinner than a human hair, is chemically bonded to every material, drastically reducing the surface energy that results in reduced corrosion and water damage. Furthermore, the coating does not affect connectivity or working components, maintaining the original look, feel, and functionality. At the end of the process, the air pressure is increased once more, and the product can be removed from the machine. It is now fully protected, and no further processing steps are required. P2I's process is the proven liquid repellent solution, validated through high-volume manufacturing. P2I offers a range of solutions to device manufacturers so that they can offer more reliable products, meaning your device can go anywhere you need to go, safe in the knowledge it's protected from water damage. I'm Natasha and I'm here from P2I demonstrating our hydrophobic nano coating technology. So P2I, what, what is all this stuff you're showing here? Well, I'm going to start with the tissue. This is a bit of a party trick for us. Uh, one of these is treated with our nano coating technology and the other one isn't. Now, the coating is a thousand times thinner than a human hair, so actually you can't see a difference, you can't feel a difference, but if I put these into the water, you're going to see a very big difference. So our normal tissue is all wet like you'd expect, but on our hydrophobic tissue, the water simply beads up and rolls off. And the way so your company, you make a tissue? What do you do? <laughs> we don't make tissues, we make the coating. So working with electronic manufacturers like Motorola and TCL, we apply this technology onto electronic devices. And I'm going to show you why here. So normally when you get your components wet, you can see that the water spreads out on the surface. And in fact, in this point right in here, capillary action is pulling that water into the foam. Now, on our hydrophobic foam, instead of being pulled into the device, the water beads up. So the water molecules are now more interested in themselves than that. And if I give it a little tip, that water will come straight off. So, is your technology on the market or not yet? Absolutely. We launched in um, October 2011 with Motorola, and in October 2012 we launched with TCL, so Alcatel One Touch. TCL, what is this? Now this we're very excited about because this is almost our next generation technology. It's got similar hydrophobic benefits to splash proof, but it's got a barrier technology. So it's actually physically stopping the water molecules from interacting with the electronics. Okay, so can you show something? That enables us to have had this phone under the water for an hour and 55 minutes now. Oh, sorry, you, you wanted to leave it there even longer. Because... We're just going to leave it in there all night. Yeah. <laughs> and nice. in fact, on our booth at... Is that like a standard Samsung Galaxy S3? This is a standard Samsung so Galaxy you, S3. 
Um, it depends on the price of the phone. So it, the cost is normally absorbed directly by the manufacturers. Like so the consumer doesn't see. Or what is it? A consumer won't see any increase in cost. Soon enough, all the phones are going to be waterproof. Well, this is actually a water repellent technology, not waterproof. But so, it's water right now. <laughs> I know, but waterproof as a, as a definition implies that no water is getting into the device. And actually, here, this phone has water inside of it. It's full of water right now. It's full of water right now. But it's still working. But it's still working.